when the uh, Paralympic Games were on in London, there was uh, one fellow we kept talking about because, uh, well, he's from Ottawa and he was winning all kinds of medals and stuff. Uh, matter of fact, he's a five-time Paralympian. Uh, won a bunch of medals, won two at the London Games. Uh, Jason Dunkley is here. Welcome. Thank you. Yeah, listen, we're right proud of you, my friend. We were uh, watching your, uh, your every move over there. Good for you. Congratulations. Oh, thanks very much. How was that uh, Paralympic experience for you? It was amazing, you know, just being in London. Um, I think it's just uh, has, it's a lot of cultural relevance for a lot of us, you know. Um, being born over there myself in the UK and Northern Ireland, yeah. just great to be close to home. And they just did a, a fantastic job with the games and yeah. every, every part of it, you know. So you, went, uh, you went over to your homeland after, right? Yeah, we did actually, just for a few days. And just uh, my wife had never been over and um, right. hadn't been back in a long time. So just really nice to... Yeah, nice to be back there, connect with relatives, and just uh, that's cool. People. Yeah. One thing we thought was great at the Paralympics, Jason, was the fact that uh, we saw you uh, getting your medal, and we saw your guide, your running partner, get a medal too, and we mm. thought that was uh, quite nice. Yeah, it's the first time that guide runners have yeah. ever been given a medal. So, and it's, I mean, it's great because with Josh and myself, we really are uh, a team out there. It's not like you're out there as an individual, which is usually the case with running, you know. So yeah. um, just great to share in that together, you know. Great for Josh. You've got your uh, Army Run t-shirt on, your, your running shirt, and you're all ready for this weekend. Uh, are you running the half marathon? What are you doing? No, I'm running the 5K. The uh, 5K? With, uh, with the injured soldiers. So um, it's, uh, yeah, it's going to be fantastic. Really looking forward to yeah. it. Yeah. And I know you think this is really important to do. I think it is, you know. I mean, I think these, uh, these soldiers, these, these guys are... Um, you know, out there, uh, out there protecting us, and uh, just uh, really incredible role models for yeah. for myself, definitely. And a lot of times, and I'm sure you've met people along the way. There are injured soldiers who uh, uh, have been on the front lines and come back home, and uh, you know, we gotta we gotta look after them, make sure uh, they get their lives back on track after mm -hmm. an injury like that. And that's uh, sort of kind of what the uh, army runs all about. Yeah, you know, last year just um, sort of being around, talking to some of the some of the soldiers. You know, it's incredibly um, humbling, you know, just what some, of, what some of them have been through and what they've, um, you know, sort of given up and, and they're coming back, fighting, fighting to get back and have their dignity and, and just yeah. here running. It's just amazing. Yeah, really I'm is. sure you've met guys who have lost their eyesight, for example, and, and limbs and so on. It's, yeah, and it's just, incredible what they go through. Just sort of having through. to relearn how to sort of do things that, that people might take for granted. It's just, um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you know, it really makes you think. Uh, along those lines, I want to point out to people that you, uh, your career is uh, kind of centered around uh, people with disabilities and, and helping them out, right? Yeah, I work uh, for an organization, the Active Living Alliance for Canadians with a Disability, and uh, we're trying to um, encourage people with disabilities to be active, you know, to be involved, to be engaged in their communities, trying to support uh, recreation organizations to include people with disabilities. Um, just sort of give them simple ideas on how to do that. And it's, uh, I mean, just being active can just do so much for you. Quality of life, yeah. uh, social inclusion, just lots of great stuff that comes from that. Yeah, because you've never discluded yourself, right? You've, uh, you've managed to get through your life. You were bl uh, born uh, blind, like your two brothers. Mm -hmm. And uh, you've ne never really let anything stop you. No, I mean, I think you just, you just uh, as a young person, you want to be involved. And I mean, I think being, being born with a disability is a little bit different from acquiring a disability yeah. later on because yeah. you're... I've never sort of missed what I haven't had, but people who acquire disability have to sort of relearn. So it's a bit different, but um, yeah, I mean, I think you just make the best of every situation. Yeah, you, know? you, you, you adapt, mm -hmm. right? Definitely. Um, any more Paralympics in your future? What's the story? I'm uh, not sure. <laughs> You've been uh, to five, right? I've been to, I've been to four, so, um, so if I was to go to Rio, it would be my fifth one. But, but it's Rio, buddy. It's, it is Rio. That's, that's what my wife keeps saying. <laughs> yeah. She wants to go. <laughs> so we're going to go for uh, next year. We have a world championship in, um, in France that I'm hoping to, to compete in the 5,000 meters. And then uh, we'll go from there. You know? Right, right. Yeah. See what happens down the road. For sure. But it'd be a, a kind of a cool thing to do number five in it Rio. Would. It would, for sure. Yeah. 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 Well, listen, uh, best of luck along the way. Have fun this weekend at Thank the Army Run, and maybe next year I'll join you. As I mentioned, I went for my first run yesterday in, uh, in quite some time, and uh, I'm one hurting unit today, but <laughs> I'll get over it. I'll no, that, sound, that sounds good. Hope to see you there next okay, year. Okay, buddy. Okay. Jason Dunkerley is uh, participating, like many others, in a, a fabulous event. The Army Run is uh, coming up this weekend with all kinds of activities for everybody. If you see people uh, running this weekend, make sure you cheer them on. Give them your best.